then that forces them to come down the centre road where we can hit the Bane Blade after the infantry's passed. Because if they think that we have mines down, they won't let the Bane Blade go through without sending the infantry first. Uh, we don't have much crack, do we? I've got two. Okay. We're just going to have to make that first shot count. Hey, they can do a little bit too. Yeah. Okay. I've only got frag, smoke, and a shitload of stun. <laughs> yeah. Stun the bane blade. You could stun the infantry. Stun the stun the pilots of the bane blade, all of them. <laughs> Actually, uh, if only well, they had the no, they can drop bottom. a stun grenade inside once we rip off the hatch. The hatch. No, drop yeah, a smoke grenade. They won't be able to see their damn controls. Drop the stun grenade, then a smoke grenade. <laughs> Use the stun grenade to, just to make stop sure. the infantry from just Why not drop both a stun and a frag at the same time? You have two hands. Just <laughs> double fist it down there. All right, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad nobody has debt charges. Yeah, yeah we don't again, have a that's, that. that's right. <clears throat> Then again, that kind of totally so destroying. Running around thinking about how we're going to steal a fucking bane blade. <laughs> <laughs> the we're all just kind of chatting on the rooftop possible. as to how we're going to do this. Just a plume of dust in the distance. Oh, we got like Christ, half an hour left. Road. Okay. Uh, Everyone's taking a smoke break. <laughs> We've got a half hour left, and we're all discussing about Remember, the cool shit that we're going to do. <laughs> you still smoke a low. Ditches and lows. Ditches and lows. <laughs> <laughs> ditch to ditch, low stick to low stick. <laughs> I I prefer the Commissar Dan, but... Uh, yeah. Commissar Dan was pretty great. Then they killed him. <laughs> Look, he was doing a charge in a basilisk. <laughs> Against the hell brute. Uh, Take me closer. I want to hit him with my sword. Well, no, it was charge you, p and then he died. I know. He, he didn't actually get to finish the quote because censorship. Yeah. <laughs> I would have been about as startled if uh, they had actually included the whole thing there as I was when I saw that one fateful yeah. edition of Family Circus. <laughs> oh, that one. That was hilarious. It, it It's okay. FFG just kind of makes everything canon. And uh, honestly, that happened during the um, Dawn of War 2 Let's Play and everybody flipped the fuck out. It was great. Yeah. <laughs> like, it actually ran in newspapers. Yeah. All okay. right, be right, be right what's, back. What's your plan? You get off Russia, charge. Do you want to charge the pain blade? Excellent. No. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> sorry, no, no, no. I asked what you plan is. Oh my god. <laughs> you misheard him. He wants to charge the pain blade. Okay. How I to <laughs> no, I want to send thirteen to charge the pain blade. Uh, but if he dies, how am I supposed to heal you? <laughs> so, yeah, are you setting up any traps, or...? Um, let's see. We could probably set one of those crack grenade or crack things so that whenever that bane blade goes nearby, it, could, it runs it over and blows up. Yeah, we've uh, used the... Um, frag grenades as trip mines down the left and right sides uh, we can also, off my arrows uh, we can also use the uh, Talia Godwin's well, last carbine again they I don't just really thought of something um, Bane blades have of oh, a lot of armor, armor that also, actually works against Righteous Fury so we could be in trouble for throwing the tr tracks you basically have to hit the front wheel on the track. That's why Kid was literally going to just go inside and kill everyone inside the Bane Blade. 
the whole point is that we're going to go on top of, jump on top of it, rip the hatch up with, uh, you know, Mr. Yeah. Unnatural Strength, and uh, then <laughs> then drop Check a bunch, bunch of, of grenades explosives inside. explosives down it. Yeah. Let's um, give them a good sprinkle of frags, yeah. Well, we're talking <laughs> about this. I suppose Sam is trying to get himself into a little sniper perch so he's not immediately spotted. You're probably going to want to be on a different building than the rest of us, then. Yeah. Or, yeah. like, inside. That. Like a floor down or so. Initiative. On the other hand, you're also going to want to be in a place where you can get away, because it is a Bane Blade. If it shoots at the building, it's gone. Period. Yeah. It's, it's not bad so, bad. yeah, different building. Something like that, actually. Well, the demolisher works. cannon's only got a range of 50. So... Yeah, you know, it's got to get a bit close before it can blow the hell out of you. So yeah. ideally, you'll be back. You can actually go back further than going forward. Um, Badoop. Well, I meant like the building along the main road on uh, the side there. You can actually get a nice line of sight down the road and have a good shot at picking off the um, Wait, the commander because you know he he might be in the couple. Ah, like, like I here. Think enough, the commander is just a cold shot. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Like, also, like I'm, just, I'm just wondering I where. Just, I just like because your range is ridiculous. While we're preparing, oh. Knut is going to be lying prone on top of the thing so that yeah. he can't be seen. Technically, ah, very good policy. I use I mentor so I can stealth for Knut. <laughs> But regardless, should I make a stealth roll or don't even bother? Don't bother. You're hiding in a building. Yeah. All right. Let me check and see what my range is because I'm pretty sure I can still shoot everybody from this distance. I'm pretty sure your range is more than the Bane Blade's range. Uh, long last is 150. Is its basic range? Bane Blade cannon seven. Seven hundred fifty meters. Three D ten plus fifteen. Hey, a realistic. Max. Luz Carvine is 75 meters, by the way. So, so that's what wait, most was wait. We, we have a realistic medium range in a Fantasy Flight game? Yeah. The Demolisher's 50. Uh, uh, well, that's against emplacements. It's probably yeah. not a rifle at all or anything. Yeah, it's basically the old Sturm Tiger. Mm -hmm. it's basically or just the little... uh, KV-2. Yeah, or the Churchill AVRE. Yeah. Ooh, my line of sight's actually pretty bad. Line of sight everywhere that isn't the road's going to be pretty bad with all these trees. And well, there's like oh, undulating right hills. right on the corner, that's not that bad. Yeah. Imagine but, all yeah. these buildings are standard imperial, so they're going to be like five, six stories. So, you yeah, know, 40k architecture is just massive. What's the penalty for firing beyond... Uh, is um, it up to twice max... Twice I think he range. has that talent, though. We're yeah, gonna just ignore it, I don't care. I'm just four wondering times. for most of us, because we're well outside of normal range. Um, well, we're not going to think of shooting at it until it's right next to us. So, I don't think I'm going to be shooting at it till it's right next to us, because otherwise, that kind of ruin the trap, and he'd just start firing at us. Yeah, and he, my my gun's range. My gun's not good against armor. Um, technically I could make my gun good against armor, but that'd require a lot of traits. <laughs> yeah. I don't think anyone's oh, gun is good against a Blame Blade's armor, though. A Blame Blade? At least not from the yes, a Blame Blade. <laughs> At least not from the front. You know what's good against the Bane Blade? A Shadow Sword. <laughs> so another Bane Blade, okay. <laughs> but yeah, based on my line of sight stuff, I can really only start... To hit them when they're around this area, when they're actually entering the city. Otherwise, your building is... Otherwise, this building is cutting me off. That well, actually makes again, quite if you a move lot down, of sense, but if we want square, to split the infantry yeah. up, hitting them there, forcing them down the side streets, what? Yeah. Forcing down the side streets, what? So, okay. Well, let me get this straight. The idea is um, wait until they're just past the intersection. Like, the front edge of the Bane Blade is getting about flush with the building to the left. 
Uh, I'm just going to call it Building 35 just for simplicity's sake. Uh, you pop the commander, assuming that he's visible. I mean, yeah, he might not be. Yeah. If he's visible, pop the commander. We jump down. Infantry hopefully scatters into the mines. We get in and then and murder everyone inside. Man the guns and then mow down the infantry around us while someone makes sure they don't do the exact same thing to us. Knut will stand uh, I would recommend you move it. after taking the sh- shot, though. Yes. <laughs> Jump off the building. <laughs> Luckily, so. your stupid initiative will mean that um, you you pretty much guaranteed to go first. I think that's the only way you can put it. Our stupid initiative. Yeah. 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 I was gonna say hilarious. Uh, we followed the we followed the Tao of Trosk. Breaking all the games. <laughs> Fantasy flight games are kind of broken. All RPGs are broken when you get down to it. Oh, yeah. It's something yeah. you can do to every RPG because it'll break it. It's just at a matter of. A, at least it's not a 3.5 wizard. Oh, God. Godzilla? <laughs> Alright, so. Godzilla. Shall we keep going? Yeah. Yep. Let's go then. So, shall we all roll initiative now? Yep. Oh, God. I now, how did it get that again? <laughs> Someone else picked up uh, combat formation, right? Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> oh, so it's plus 10 Hey! Now. I didn't lose the my luck. That, the fact that we can get up to 20 is so dumb. <laughs> I, I rolled low. I'm sad. <laughs> oh no, you rolled a 12. <laughs> if we had gone a couple more sessions in the Rogue Trader game, Charles would have been able to hit a 32. <laughs> <laughs> oh well... Anyway, I'm I'm 18, not 17, since I had it at hmm. last night. I won't let you delete the old lettering guy. That is obscene. Okay. And, uh, yeah, I can shoot that center, assuming that's where the commander is. It's, uh, I've got to roll my initiative. <laughs> oh, hey, I'm the just bar- is reasonably fast. Guess what? I'm actually barely inside my... Um, Inside long range. If it were just a little bit closer, it'd be with the 150. I'm not last. <laughs> so really, it should be an easy shot then. Well, I still don't get this. Uh, don't get the short range. Uh, I do get unaware, which is plus 30. And if I do a full round to aim, that's plus 30. So yeah, no, I get the whole plus 60. You, you hit. <laughs> just a matter of how badly do I hit. It's like that scene from. Well, well, we do sh- want it to, to get it a little further forward. Cold it's shot a, to the eye. Eye. We, won't to get to we went it closer <laughs> though. If we went them. To, we went the tank to be close enough for us to jump on it. Okay. You know, I think I'm going to do a cold shot as well because that's within my normal range, and I have sharpshooter and that eye shot. Oh yeah. Oh, and a hell They're going to hit the mines. Yep, they're yes. going to spread out. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, no, I think actually within my short range. So the, it's actually going to be about there by the time the Again, two the side squads spread out a little bit and hit the mines. Well, all right, so I've been aiming the entire time. Is the commander visible? Yes, I'll be nice and let the commander be visible. All right, oh. same for me, I guess, then. God, all right. Um, he's unaware... Uh, aim shot, and is he full full round aim with the uh, accurate weapon? Yeah. Accurate weapon. So I'm at plus sixty. Yeah, I will be firing a call. Yes, I think oh, I'm at plus sixty. The as cold well. shot is to the head. Yeah, I was about to say because otherwise, if you hit below the waist, he's just gonna ping off the pain blade. Yeah, Sam. Yeah. <laughs> Headshot though. Yeah. Yeah, Sam. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, and this yeah, and this was overcharged. Like never not. Sorry about that. Oh wait, I said frag grenades. That's not correct. It's my uh 
Well, whatever. It yeah. had the same, same, same skill. A weapon. He has that. I threw a frag grenade <laughs> directly at his head. He's dead. Eat it. <laughs> that would be pretty impressive. Ooh, nice damage. I think he's dead. <laughs> yeah, you also got a... You also no, got I a did not. On him, so. No, the Righteous Fury only triggers on the uh, first die. If it doesn't trigger with that, then it doesn't trigger at all. Yeah. What, is that a specific thing on accurate? Uh, it specifically says that for accurate. Okay. These extra D10s cannot trigger uh, Righteous Fury. Okay. So, okay. even with uh, Clack just... Armor, uh, taking seven points off that, yeah, you kind of just slaughter the commander. <laughs> what commander? <laughs> read, the, read the fluff text. I want to see. Um, okay. <laughs> it's a... Energy, um, energy, energy. critical. Energy critical. To the head. To the head. One second, I've completely lost it. I've got it. You want me to read it out? Yeah, go for it. Superheated by the attack, the target's brain explodes, tearing apart his skull and sending flaming chunks of meat <laughs> flying at those nearby. The target is very dead. <laughs> and on top of that, since it was uh, over 10 apparently, uh, the target's body also catches on fire and runs off headless 2 to 10 meters in a random direction. Here's the scatter diagram on, t- on page 255. But Anything flammable passes, including oh. characters, must make a challenging agility chest or catch on fire. The body's in, in the, the cupola. Tank. It can't really go anywhere. Uh, it's, it, it's just going to burn in the cupola. <laughs> it will be hilarious, though. Yeah, I was going to say, on a bad roll, I'll have it slip back down into the tank. But no. <laughs> on a what? On a bad roll. If oh, so, roll, like, you know, 90-something or whatever. Yeah, 90 or something, that, it would have fallen back into the tank, and then it would have got interesting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right, yep, yeah, you've annihilated the commander. And it looks like this squad's going to hit your minds. <laughs> Wait, you have plus three? Yeah, I'm not quite sure where that plus three's come from. Yeah. Uh, um, what's its but still, that's, See, isn't that a righteous fury with the mines? Or can you not righteous fury with those? Well, it's technically a grenade. It's a grenade. You yeah. just kind of break grenades with them, um, like... Tripwire. Um, yeah. That's going to kill off two members of squad two. Ah, How many squad. Are right. in squads. So, yeah. Yeah. How many this members? is ten. Ten. This is thirty. Thirty people. And a bane blade. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> so a platoon so, reinforcing. Oh, that's a full platoon. You've, okay. Yeah, you've heard on your radios so that there's um, other platoons are kind of flanking out, moving around the other sides. So. <laughs> Yeah, they're, they're attacking the city. They're not attacking because they don't think there's anyone here, but yeah. they're, they're making sure they're not all marching down the same road. Well, I think they know they're he- we're here. Yeah. Well, they know there's one person here. They don't know <laughs> more than that. Okay, so the, it'll be round two. This will be back to Sam. Um, I suppose that means I should get the fuck off this building. Normally, yes. Yeah, so with the um, grab shoot on my back that I only am now take, lugging around because otherwise it'd be on Knut, um, I will try to jump off with my companion. Top of the aeronautica at plus 20, by the way. Yeah. Okay, so it's an agility roll plus 20. Did anyone else, just as a bit of a random aside... Uh, see the 79 year old uh, D Day veteran who was who did a tandem jump yesterday. I heard yeah, about that. I heard about I that. See anything I think he was 82. Is he 82? I can't it, remember. It doesn't matter. He's old and he went on a tandem jump, which is kind of awesome. Yes. And the. Uh, and as for Bill, he makes a separate roll. Okay. Um, well, I'm just asking. He makes a separate roll. And uh, like, no, he's commanded. He, yeah. he makes it down. Okay. So Comrades, both... always follow your movement exactly. Yeah, Yeah. okay. Yeah. Then we both um, make it to the ground, and uh, as far as I know, that's my entire action for the round. Yep. So just move yourself to the right position. Hmm? You have. Yeah. Oh, sorry. That went a bit weird. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, I'm not sure the combat I could make us? the jump. 
Oh, um, wait, no, never mind. Never mind. I remember. This is a thing that you can open up yourself. Yeah. Okay, 89 year old Jock Hutton. 89. 89 okay. year old oh. Jock Hutton, a Scotsman. That sounds Scotsman correct. Are crazy. <laughs> All right, so. Um... Yeah, Faye? Okay, I'm, I'm just thinking because I can get to it this turn. I'm just. Hmm. Oh, did it did it move forward at all? By the way, uh, no, because this is a point where the troops started moving out, and you realised that your trap was about to get sprung anyway. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I was just saying because that entire turn went by after the shot, so. Well, well, that was kind of like surprise round. Oh, okay. So. Um, I think yeah, I'll go ahead and run. Why is someone rotating me? Sorry. And basically uh, take cover it. behind the turret on it. Okay. Make you drop. Uh, I, I'm using yes, my wings. flyer. Oh, flyer, yes. I forgot you're one of just my characters. fly. <laughs> yeah. You can just Jump do axe. that. Uh, how long is each combat round? Ten seconds? Six, I think. Six. I think. 13, isn't it? Six. Oh, no. All right. Six, yeah. Okay, so he can do it for ten rounds, and then he has to make toughness tests. Yeah. Yeah, okay. someone's probably going to want to throw smoke to obscure the guy. What the hell is this thing doing? Um, looking at it, it's saying that Bay is 19, Sam has 19, I have 17, and Serge has 17. Yeah, so it's but, probably. Yeah, I just went, I clicked the down button and it moved up. <laughs> Odd. Seems about right. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds about right for Fantasy Grounds. Mm. Now available on Steam. <laughs> Alright, still better than um, Roll20. I like Roll20. Roll20 is pretty nice. Yeah, yeah. it just doesn't have... Uh, it's it, a bit yeah, it doesn't do all of the shiny things. They've yeah. actually added character sheets in now. Yeah, after like two years. Yeah. Let's do an RPG thing. How long does it take you to add character sheets? <laughs> it's because their oh, funding is guess, actually very good they're the barely scraping wall. full time like production yeah. that yeah. was my reaction I'll go That's ahead so and uh, rip the flaming corpse out of the cupola <laughs> and chuck it up at the side uh, great squad one should have took some damage from a frag grenade as well okay roll for that it was exactly oh, I did. the same it's exactly the same right underneath okay 17 again but a 9 and a 5 but for some reason it's done plus 3 again but I don't know why although it might be because it's blast 3 which makes no sense but I don't know okay so is it okay? Uh, yeah well, it's not really close up enough for me so I guess I'll, I'll shoot at some infantry or because I'm doing just a drop onto it I can't jump to it Maybe throw some smoke? Um, the more confused this is, the better it'll go for Like, it. do we throw the smoke on ourselves, or do I Down throw smoke the street? Because the... we're above it, they're yeah. in it. Ah, uh, wouldn't it be better served throwing a frag grenade down onto them? Only if you want 30 men to have a clear line of sight on the tech priest currently standing on top of the giant tank. Yeah. I mean, sure, I'll throw the smoke grenade down then. I mean, it's up to you, man. I'm just saying. Like, also, I totally point, don't have the range to do that. I can only throw it at nine meters. Yeah, but you only need to throw it like two meters out, and then it'll drop the rest of the way. Yeah. Oh shit! And really? Yeah, it's we're, two so meters we're so high up, it'd probably go a bit further than that. Mm. That's, it's I'm up assuming to you, man. the nine meters is assuming, and that's your normal range. You could technically throw further, and since you have that talent, that lets you. Ignore range penalties. You can. I don't. That's the. That's, oh, no? the um, okay. that's the rat line. Oh, okay. Yeah. Unfortunately, yeah. I don't have that yet. Yeah, it's up to you. I like, if you want to put some up. fire down and draw some heat off the tech priest, then either way. It'd yeah, work. it's it's marksman or sharpshooter. I forget which one it is. It's marksman. Yeah, totally marksman allows you to negate have. any sort of uh, ranged penalties. I'm just saying I don't have the range to throw those according to the rules unless Greta says, yeah, sure, go ahead. 
if you drop them, but throwing them, you know, dropping some, throwing something <laughs> off a building would probably be very inaccurate. Yeah, yeah. just I'll shoot some people then. It's yep, okay. no problem, I will. I'll, I'll shoot things. I'll shoot my hot shot last gun. It's at, time to uh, shot three. Oh, we totally have a height advantage on them too, don't we? Yep. Yes, we do. That's another yeah. plus 10. Hell te- yeah. Technically, so do I, because Bane Blades are fuck off huge. All right, so Squad 3 is within my short range. I'm at plus 20 for... Uh... Yeah, I'm at plus 20 because I'm using semi-auto. I should just aim first, too. What am I doing? There we go. You hit. Okay, squad what? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I got all three hits, too. Um, okay, switch squad side. Uh, three. Hitting the... It doesn't matter which location, it's a squad. Yeah. And goodness, that's a hot shot. So, yeah, that hurts real bad. Mm hmm. 10 7, yeah. Why is it 8? Do you have Mighty Shot? or? Yes, I do. Okay. That's what I got instead <clears throat> of Marksman. I do more damage on shots. I would have picked up Mighty Shot, but I only have one aptitude right now. I can wait till I get long shooter to get two aptitudes. So what, you're going to be even more better at guns? Um, there aren't that many offense ones that I really want, so not as much as you'd think. Well, I mean, the going to long shooter, you're going to be even more better at guns. Um, I can use my ally, which also requires the errata to be updated, to um, add my degrees of success to penetration, yeah. I see, I see. Right, so how many um, shots did you hit with three? Oh shit, that's right. I'm, I'm an idiot. <clears throat> yeah, okay. And? <laughs> I hit with all three. Yeah. Yep. And you're aiming to do seven point. at least if you do eight points of damage more, you kill one. And they're all pen uh, seven. Uh, pen um, seven. Okay, so three. if you do three points of more damage, yeah. So, so you, you, you just automatically... kill three. <laughs> so that puts that kill squad at seven strong? Yep. Hmm. And it skips Ray. house for some reason. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Never mind then. No, no, I'll let house go and then I'll describe my awesomely good idea. Alright, I'm going to just throw a grenade at Bloodstream 3. That's within range, normal. Yep. So, uh, let's see, that's made. Half action aim, right? And uh, it's just an unmodified ballistic skill check. Yeah, I mean, so. half action aim. Yeah, definitely you can aim with a grenade. No, it literally says you can own, you use an unmodified ballistic skill check. Oh, okay. Well, here's my frag grenade then. I, I have made a terrible mistake. I did two less on each of those. I, just I listed it. both. I listed both uh, the mighty shot and also the damage has if it had mighty shot. My bad. So hey, at least it can't scatter into any of us. Nope. Yeah. Well, the scatter would scatter be scatter into- how many? Ra- how much is the scatter? One D five. How far does the scatter go? It won't be. It won't scatter from on the square. See, see, remember, we're also f- like five to six stories up. I don't think it can stick. I don't think it can scatter up the up the building. No, oh, yeah, you're thinking, on top of that, no, you're, you're scattering on a squad. In fairness, if it can't scatter more than a square, that it's going to hit squad three, no matter yeah. what. <clears throat> It's more just checking to see if you drop the thing without actually throwing it. Yeah, if you fumble it, you're in trouble. Yeah. Hey, grenades count. I didn't range fumble numbers. it. I rolled a 77 out of 43, but still. Yeah, so Letrian Squad 3 take 2d10 damage. Right, Gray? Yep. Come on, roll. <laughs> 